Hi guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Rosie and I love to film shopping hauls, clothing hauls, I do a few vlogs. So if you enjoy that sort of thing, definitely consider subscribing to the channel. But without further ado, let's get on into this video. Today's video is a huge home bargains haul. I am actually surrounded by stuff at the minute, so I'm really, really keen to get on into the video. The video has very, very kindly been sponsored by Caster Crafts Candles. It is a candle and wax melt company, so I really wanted to include it on this video because I feel like with homeware, home decor and all of that, candles definitely come into it. I think you're going to love them. So let me tell you a little bit about the company. So they're called Caster Craft Candles. They make candles and wax melts in lots and lots of different scents. They're a very, very small family run business, which I absolutely love supporting small businesses. The candles are 100% soy wax. They are vegan and cruelty free. They contain no toxic chemicals. So they're not going to be harmful to your health or anything like that. They are made with natural wax, high quality fragrance oils. They also have quite a different range of candles like the wood wick ones, the cotton wick ones. The one I've got burning behind me just here is the fairy dust one and I don't know if you can hear it but it crackles as it burns. It's a really really cool wick. I've never seen it before so I'm really excited about that one and it smells absolutely amazing. I have been testing them out. They did send me a bunch of things to test out which I have and the house has been smelling amazing and I also have wax melts that around the house so let me show you the packaging because it is just incredible so I have got a few boxes packaged like this and I haven't opened these up because I wanted to save them to open up with you on camera so you can choose to have your packages gift box like this and they'll come like this in this beautiful box with a gold bow or if you just order them without gift wrap they do come packaged in these gorgeous little packets like this okay let's open up this box oh god as soon as I open that, the smell is so good. Okay, so I have two candles in here and the packaging on them is absolutely gorgeous. It's neutral, I love neutral packaging and it has the bamboo lid, which goes with so much in my house already. This is the watermelon dakuri, which I think is the one that I could smell as soon as I opened it. I smell this like fruity scent. That smells so good. I think that's my favorite one so far. That's really, really nice. And then the next one I have in here is the dragon's blood and again, it's in lovely packaging same as that one but in black with a bamboo lid these I just love because I think you can put them on your side and they just go with any sort of decor oh that's kind of like a a perfumey scent definitely smells like more of a, a deeper scent this one's like the other one was like fresh and fruity this is more of like your deeper like I would say like wintry scents. This is like summery, this is wintry. Okay, so moving on, I think this is a little box of wax melts. Look how gorgeous this packaging is. Think of this as a gift for somebody. You could just send this directly to their house in the post, it's so easy. It already comes gift wrap. Oh my God, it's so cute, look. So in here we have a little box of blue wax melts and all of the wax melts have like little bits of glitter and things in them so they look really pretty, they're really aesthetic. So this one is in the scent Twilight Blush. That, oh that, that reminds me of something in Lush. It smells like a Lush bath bomb that I've used before. I can't put my finger on which one it is but it has that nice sweet soapy kind of scent to it so next up i have another box to unbox feels like christmas today also these boxes are so good for like reusing or storing your candles and wax melts in so i definitely recommend like getting your first box gift wrapped because then you get all these boxes and stuff with it which is lovely oh these are like real like glamorous ones look at those so this is a couple of gold ones and again it's in this beautiful gold packaging so I love candles with the little gaps in I don't know if you can see it. it kind of looks speckled but they are like little gaps through so when you light the candle and it goes down you do get like the candle glow coming through the candle so I really love the style of these it looks so nice this one is called J'adore so I'm hoping it's going to be like the J'adore perfume and yet yeah, smells like perfume this smells like you know when you've just cleaned the house and you just want to light a candle and give it that final fresh scent this is the one you'd like it smells really good, really nice, clean, fresh scent with that like perfumey smell. Next up we have this one which again is in the same sort of packaging but this is in a plain gold container. Um, now this is in the scent Monkey Farts which I've seen so many different candle brands do this scent like Monkey Fart. I think it's supposed to be, yeah, really fruity. So basically monkeys obviously eat loads of different fruits um, so 
this is what it smells like when they fart. I'm sure it doesn't, but this smells really good. Oh, that is that is a very strong, that's the strongest one of all of them. I'd say if you like a strong fruity candle, go for the monkey farts because that is lovely. So that is all the bits I have to show you from Caster Craft Candles. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything that I got. I've got wax melts burning at the moment and the house is just smelling so good. And I just absolutely love their packaging and the effort that goes into it. The fact that they're a family run business is absolutely amazing. So I do have a discount code for you. It is Rosie Tilly. I'll pop it on the screen now and I'll also leave it in the description box below. Thank you so much to Caster Crafts Candles for working with me on this video. Now let's get into this Home Bargains haul. Okay, so I've got two big bags to get through and then I have other stuff that doesn't fit in bags. So let's start with the bags, I think. I'm gonna do this in no particular order. So first I bought this Coconut Mineral Body Wash. So it's from the Dead Sea collection, which I've seen in Home Bargains for, I think it's been in there for years actually. It's quite like a well-known brand in there. But I loved this packaging because it's a pump bottle and it's really, really big. So I'm really happy with this one. It was only $1.99 and you get one litre of body wash in here, which is just obviously amazing. I just want to smell it. Mm. It smells okay. Like, I'm not sure. It's not very strong. It smells like coconut, but like nothing else. But I guess it is called coconut body wash. Maybe that's what I should have expected. I feel like coconut products need to be mixed with something else just to make them smell a little bit more than just coconut. But if you love coconut scent, then I'm sure you will love this one. The reason I did get this though is because of the bottle, because I thought I can then refill this with whatever body wash that I like and I can have like a pump dispenser, which I do quite like the look of this one as well. So next up, I picked up the Garnier Ultra Blends shampoo and conditioner. If you love this stuff, this is the best place to buy it. Home Bargains does it like half price. I'm pretty sure it's been half price in there for maybe like six months. So I don't know if that's like a regular thing. I thought I would try out the papaya and coconut one. Oh, it's coconut again, but it's got papaya in it. So that's good. It'll smell a bit more fruity. I usually get the banana ones of these. I love the banana one. Actually, I've got the banana mask, which I'll show you in a minute. But I thought I'd try this because it says for damaged hair and I have had more highlights put in my hair. So it does feel a little bit drier. So I wanted to buy something to help with that. That's quite a strong fruity scent. That does smell nice actually. Oh, the conditioner smells a little bit better. It's not as nice as the banana scent in my opinion, but it still smells really nice and it's very strong. So I think it'll probably like last on the hair. So they were $2.99 each. And then, like I said, I did also get the banana hair mask. I've been using this hair mask for oh, I don't know, maybe a year now. I absolutely love it. This is my third pot of it. They are quite big pots. You do get, how much in here? You get 390 mil in here, which is quite big. But what I like to do with this is not only does it make your hair smell absolutely amazing, it is a three-in-one hair mask. It's designed for dry hair, so you can use it as a conditioner, as a mask, or as a leave-in. I actually use it as a leave-in, so I do shampoo and conditioner in the shower or the bath. And then I, when I come out and I towel dry my hair, I then run this through like the ends of my hair where it's been highlighted and it just leaves my hair feeling really soft and smooth and then I can blow dry and it doesn't get frizzy and it just works so well. And this is £3.49 in Home Bargains, whereas I think in like Boots or something, it's around £7. So yeah, 100% recommend this one. I love it. Okay, next up, I picked up this body lotion, mainly because I loved the packaging. I just thought it was was absolutely beautiful and the colours of it are really nice too. It's from the Tammy's and Jackson range which I've never heard of but the reason also that I got this was because it was only 49p. It said it was originally I think something like 6 99 and it was down to 49p. I thought I would get it. It says it's lime and rayhan with ginger extract. It's a body lotion, I don't know if I said that. Oh that smells really nice. It doesn't smell anything like lime at all um so it must be more of the ray ham which i've never heard of yeah that does smell really nice it's very spa like okay next up bit of a boring one i just got a lighter i really like using these ones i just find them so easy to use and where i do light a lot of candles i like to like 
you know put it down into the candle when it's like melted and you can easily do it with these i have also bought long matches as well which i love i didn't buy them from here i bought them somewhere else but yeah long matches i really like but yeah this was only 99p in home bargains which i think is a really good price okay i've got a bit of food to show you this was on their like special buys when you first walk in i have already eaten one of these and they're really good so they're large and moist coconut macaroons you get 10 in a pack they come in this packaging i really like them because they were individual wrapped which I know is probably not like ideal like with the excess packaging but if I'm going to work or like I just know I'm going out and I'm gonna need a little snack something like this is perfect because you can just bring it out with you and it's really easy to just eat I'm just gonna try a bit because I had one yesterday and it's so good and I really fancy another one that's what they look like when you open them up and they're really they are really moist and nice I'm mm. They're so good to me they taste like a freshly baked cake and they're like sort of gooey in the middle as well um yeah if you like macaroons i think you will like these they're just so tasty okay so next i have this gorgeous little velvet headband i love this i love the color of it i love wearing headbands when i'm doing makeup in the morning just to get like my hair out of the way especially now i've got a fringe like it does get in the way a little bit so something like this really helps they had a whole range of stuff in with this packaging and it is khm kate hayes like i don't know I, I don't know who that is but they did have like this huge load of collaboration stuff with her so yeah definitely get down there and check that out this one was one pound 49 and from her range i also got some hair clips which were 99p and that is these hair clips which i'm really really excited about they are the ones that are supposed to not dent your hair so say you're doing your makeup or you've like curled your hair and you just want it to be like extra curls you can put like pins in between the curls to like hold them in place or you can like pin it up and hold them in place but these are going to work really well for that because they are designed yeah not to like leave that dent in your hair and there's eight hair clips in here and it was only 99p so i mean they might not last the longest but i feel like for 99p it's pretty good next i got a garnier moisture bottom tissue mask i have a whole load of these like i basically collect these masks they're so good i just love them they fit on my face so well most masks i find just don't fit my face and it drives me mad they just fall off but these ones are really good and i not sure if i've tried the pink one before i don't know i feel like i would have done because it's a glow one but i don't remember using it so when i saw it i thought i better buy that um it says it's a super hydrating and glow reviving mask for dull skin it's got hyaluronic acid in it so if you go into boots these are normally i think around three pounds to 3.99 but in home bargains they are 1.99 so i do think it's a good price i know it's a single use mask but just like once a month to have like a little special treat evening to yourself I do really recommend these okay next i saw this which is totally new i've never seen this before i've seen lip seal stuff but this one is a fresh orange blossom lip seal um it's spf 15 it's got aloe vera vitamin e and shea butter in it but it, i think it's got a little mirror in it so i'm gonna open it up and i thought what a great idea so this is the lip seal container so it's kind of like orange and then when you open it feels really nice too and then when you open it up oh that's such a good idea so you have your lip balm in here and then you have a little mirror here i don't think i've ever seen a lip balm with a mirror in it why is that not a thing it's so obvious how good that is because you can literally you know do touch up your makeup and just add a little bit on your lips and oh I'm going to add a bit now. Oh, it smells nice. It's a subtle smell. It's not too strong. I love that. That is definitely going straight in my handbag. I think it was 99p as well. Next, I bought another box of those single like cake things. Um, these are the Premium All Butter Sweethearts Butter Puff Pastries. Oh, it actually says here you get 59 calories per pastry. So I think that's pretty good. Like, as you can see, they are all individually wrapped. My brother did try one of these yesterday and he said it was like quite a hard, crispy one. I wouldn't really fancy these. These are like more what he would have. Um, so I probably won't try one because I know I won't really like them. I prefer like a softer cake thing, not like a crunchy cake. But yeah, I think they are like a puff pastry, but like crunchier. I didn't tell you how much those cakes were, did I? I think both of them, £1.89. Both packs are £1.89. So 
So next up, as we're talking about food, I bought these little bottles of Fentiman's drinks. They're really good for like their mix as well, but they also do like apple juice and orange juice and it's really nice. And I was quite surprised to see these in Home Bargains. So I've got the ginger beer one, I have the premium Indian tonic water and then I also have the Curiosity Cola. I had the Curiosity Cola last night. It's a little bit weird. It's like, it almost tastes more like dandelion and burdock compared to cola that we would know. Like it doesn't taste like your Coca-Cola one. Um, but it's still really nice and I just love these. For Say you're having a guest round or like you've got people around for dinner and you can make them a little gin and tonic and then put this on the side. I just think it looks really nice. And they're in glass bottles which of course is really recyclable. So yeah, I do really like these and it was the price that was amazing. I actually bought a whole load of these. They were only 29p each which for this brand is really really good and I already know they're nice, I already know I like them. I'm excited to try the ginger beer one, that's a little bit of a different one. Um, yeah the cola is nice but it's like an alternative cola flavour um, but yeah the Indian tonic water is probably like my favourite one because that goes well with the gin. So yeah really really pleased with them, like I said 29p each so lovely for like a special occasion. Next I've got a bit of cleaning stuff here, this is the Duck Berry Magic, I don't think I've ever tried this one before, I don't know if it's new, it's this is limited edition let me know if you've tried this one before I haven't I don't think but I do love the duck um, products they're really nice I just want to smell it oh that's really nice it doesn't smell like berries though oh, I don't know what does that smell I probably shouldn't do it too much it's quite strong I don't know what it smells like it's not like berries oh apple yeah it smells kind of like appley fruity that sort of scent really nice and it was 99p so next, sticking with the cleaning, I got this Advanced Power Window and Glass Streak Free Shine Mr. Muscle Spray. If you watched one of my last videos, I can't remember when it was, but I recently found out about the whole squeegee thing where you like have a shower, spray the shower, squeegee it, and it's just so easy to keep clean. So I have already got through a lot of this sort of stuff before. So I bought another one. I wanted to try this one as well. I'm trying like a few different ones to try and find my favourite one. I also bought another squeegee, which I'll show you in a minute because we've recently had a new shower done, which is amazing. Like I just it's so nice to have like a proper shower um so yeah i did treat myself to some of this another squeegee all to keep the shower clean this one was one pound 49. next i bought some cotton pads these are just the johnson's baby cotton pads they were 99p i love using square cotton pads i switched from using round ones to square ones quite a few months ago now and i just find the square ones I don't know, I just get a lot more use out of them. They last a lot longer. One square does so much more than like what one round one would have done. So I definitely recommend trying out the square ones if you haven't done already. But yeah, 99p for those. Next, I got a few packets of floor wipes. These wipes, they don't have like many in each pack. There's only 15 in each pack, but they are extra large wipes. So when I'm cleaning, I try and use obviously my cloths that I wash and stuff, so I'm not throwing too many things away. But when I'm just doing a speed clean, I love to grab just a floor wipe because it's so big and I can literally go through like quite a few rooms with one wipe and just wipe over everything and just do it really quickly. They really freshen up the room. I get them from a few different places. I also get the Audi ones, which are nice, but I got these ones because obviously I was in home bargains. They're only 59p each. So I did buy four of them just to keep stocked up. But yeah, they are in the apple scent. And yeah, I just really like doing that when I'm in a little bit of a rush, but I need the house just to be a bit clean. Okay, moving on to my floor stuff now. So I did get this bamboo. It's called a duck board. I don't know why it's called a duck board. I have no idea. Is it is, is that a thing? Has it always been called a duck board? But this is a bath mat alternative. So I've got this for the shower room. I just really liked the wooden one as well. I thought it was really cool. I'm going to have like a bath mat and a wooden one just because I think when you first step out, it's probably better to like step on something like this and then it's like non-slip and everything and then onto the bath mat. So yeah, I got this one. It was 9 99 It's really heavy. It feels really good quality. It's got all the little bits on there to like obviously not mark the floor or anything. So yeah, I do love this one. Perfect for the new bathroom. Okay, next I got a whole set from their kind of like rose, it's not really rose gold is it? It's kind of like a rose and black set. So I got a dustpan and brush. This is quite a nice one. It's like quite a big one so i should be able to dust a lot of dirt with that 
And then I also got this one and I was very excited about this one. So it is obviously like a dust stay, you know, you can just go around along with the tops and that. But the best thing about this one is it is Velcro. So you can just pull off the duster, chuck it in the washing and then obviously put it back on there. Because I've used a few of these in the past, but like they always like don't come off. And I'm thinking like, I need to wash it. Like after a while, it just gets disgusting. So yeah, the fact that this one is just Velcro, you just peel it off, love that. I mean, like I said earlier, I did get another squeegee just because it like matched in with the range here. So yeah, I got that to go with my little shower cleaner. I'm still very excited about the fact that I can make the shower look so shiny and clean. And it's, I actually really enjoy like the little window cleaner motion that this does. It's quite fun. How sad has life got? So the squeegee was £1.29, the duster was £1.99 and the dustpan and brush was £2.49. Okay, next I got these two caddies to go in the shower. They are like the suction ones you can just stick on the tiles. They're in a really nice like matte black colour, which I'm so pleased I got these now. And now I've seen that that candle was matte black because that black candle I'm definitely going to put in the bathroom. It's just going to go so nicely with the few little black bits that I've got. The bathroom is mainly neutral and wooden. So we've got like oak touches and then like neutral tiles. But I am going to add in a few little black touches to it because I do really like these. So yeah, because my brother lives with us, we have bought two. So he can have his own one. So he stops using my stuff. And then me and Ollie will have our own one as well. So I'm going to like maybe put them like that or like that in the shower. I'm not sure. But they were only £2.99 each. And yeah, they're just really easy to do. You don't have to like screw any nails in, anything like that. Um, you can just obviously suction them straight onto the wall. Next up, I bought this gorgeous little tray. Like I think that's what they're called, aren't they? So it is a black coloured tray with the mirror in the middle here. And I absolutely love it. It was the last one that left and it was only, let me check the price of this actually. Yeah, I was quite surprised actually, it's £4.99. I was thinking it was more £7.99, but no, it was only £4.99, which I think is absolutely amazing. It feels really heavy quality. It's from the Jeff Banks range and I just absolutely love it. I have been looking for a mirrored tray like this before. I think you can pop the, like, the candles that I showed you today, something like this with like a little selection of candles on it or a wax melt burner just looks so nice and I just think it like sort of glams up a room really nicely so yeah £4.99 in home bargains absolute bargain and then last but certainly not least I bought this which I haven't even opened yet so I'm excited to open it on camera so it is a mirror and a shelf so basically to go in the bathroom as well like above the sink really but I love the idea that it was all built in together and again it is the black colour to match in with those caddies I'm trying very carefully with the mirror to not show you the rest of the room and how messy. I'm literally surrounded by mess. It's embarrassing. So I'm really going to try not to show that. <laughs> but this is the mirrored unit. So you've got the round mirror here, which I love. Really love round mirrors at the moment. And then you've got the black shelf at the bottom here. And this is quite big, actually. It's quite a decent size. The shower room that we've had done is actually like a downstairs cloakroom shower room. So something small like this would be really, really cute in there. But they did have a few different um, mirrors and things like that to go in bathrooms. So I was quite impressed. But yeah, I loved this one so much. I just think it's really lovely. It looks quite expensive but it wasn't it was only £14.99 which is just amazing like when you look at mirrors and shelves from like suppliers who do the bathrooms it costs so much money so yeah definitely check out home bargains that is everything that I picked up from my home bargains haul I really hope you enjoyed the video definitely like if you did enjoy it and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this let me know in the comments what was your favorite thing or any bargains that you've recently found in home bargains or B&M anywhere like that because they're like my favorite shops Thank you again to Caster Crafts for sponsoring this video. Like I said earlier on in the video, I will leave all of their information linked down below. And of course, I'll leave my discount code for you if you'd like to shop with them. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you're having a lovely day, whatever you're up to. And hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye.